in today's video we are gonna see if the pet gloves wipes are better than regular wipes thank you to the company for sending us the regular and the hypoallergenic one to test on venus and apollo this was sent to us for free but this video is not sponsored if you want to see which one is better if the regular or the hypoallergenic and if they both are better than regular dobby wipes keep on watching We always try to keep ourselves a little bit active, take Venus and Apollo on adventures, and a lot of the trails, they are dirt trails, and some of them do have some type of flooring, whether cement or anything else, but the majority of trails that we do with Venus and Apollo are dirt roads, so their paws get really dirty really easily, and I don't love taking all that dirt inside the car, or bringing it back inside the house. A lot of times we use something to clean their paws, especially if it gets muddy or if it's super, super dusty. When the company reached out to me to send me the gloves, I thought this would work perfectly for paws walkies, especially when we're doing trails like this, they have a lot of dirt. So I wanna test it out after we do this small hike in the park to clean Venus and Apollo's paws as well as it could be used as a substitute for a full wash so when we get home i'm gonna try it with apollo to see how well it does cleaning a full body especially a malamute sized body also is spring season and i suffer a lot from allergies and bringing venus and apollo to the park they get in their fur a lot of allergens from pollen from different trees and bark and different animals so this will be really great to do a quick touch up and clean them a little bit really fast like that they don't bring all those allergens especially now during pollen season even if you don't suffer yourself from allergens sometimes in a lot of streets if you walk in your dog through your neighborhood People put pesticides for different insects and bugs and that pesticide stay in their fur and they're bringing that home to themselves and to your kids and your family. After a half an hour walk with Venus, we're gonna be turning around back to the car because I can wait to see how well these gloves do. If there's something similar to regular wipes that you get like for babies or like doggy wipes, a lot of times doggy wipes can be a kind of dry and at least on Venus and Apollo, I have to use a bunch of them. So I'm very curious to see how this goes. Let's go to the car and test them. So the instruction by here say to put it upside down first and start squeezing it so the liquid release onto the glove, then open them and start using them. You need to squeeze them hard. In the beginning I was squeezing them and it wasn't popping the liquid into the gloves, but after I did a good squeeze, the liquid started coming down to the other side where the gloves are. And here we have our gloves and they feel very very wet obviously because it's a pouch they like burst into the gloves they feel way more wet than any other wipes that you will use like normally those baby wipes or doggy wipes they don't feel this wet i'm not sure what i was expecting but i was not expecting to be this wet which is not a problem a lot on the contrary they feel like really good quality it doesn't feel like cheap paper material it feels really good and being so wet is doing a really good job cleaning Venus's paws on first impressions I like the material it feels really good it doesn't feel cheap at all in the beginning it took me by surprise how wet they were but now I really like it because look how well it's doing taking out all the dirt and pollen and residue from the walk. Look how dirty they came out and that was just one really quick pass. We will go home now and when we get home we will keep testing them. 
they come five per box so i organize them really quick here in the dog room so i squeeze this yes this is very hard i know you feel like a little pop and you see the liquids are going this way you felt it yeah okay yeah, now massage it in here yes so the glove gets the product Can I open it? Yes. If you're like me, the type of people that kiss their dogs, I will recommend you to obviously start by the face like that you use really clean gloves in their face first. Show me the dirty gloves. <laughs> he likes it. Your belly is in. Oh. Right. Okay, the other side, buddy. The other side. I need the other side. Oh, 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 oh. Jay turned around the gloves to use the clean side now on Venus. To be able to reuse them a little bit. You done. Ew. It's a few days later and now for sure we need to use them. It's still raining and Venus decide to go through a puddle full of mud. Venus, come back. Come back. Yeah. You're so dirty. You're so dirty. Oh yeah. Uh, Are you proud, Venus? Are you proud? I think you're gonna need two pairs. She had gotten so dirty, he actually had to swap them, turn them around to be able to clean her third and fourth leg because she was so full of mud, but they did great cleaning and I was very pleasantly surprised. Venus, can you get it off the back of the Venus. Oh Lord, look at that. Oh Lord. Oh, 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 oh yeah. <laughs> Time to put to the test the hypoallergenic pet glove wipes. This one, they're for dogs that have sensitive skin or allergies. Venus and Apollo, they don't have none of that. So I'm gonna be testing this one on Shrek, my 15 year old Yorkie. His skin is a lot more sensitive than Venus and Apollo. And also because he's very, very old, I like to use more gentle stuff. I love they say they alcohol free. A lot of products, especially for dogs, they have a lot of alcohols in all those baby wipes. They even have alcohol too. So I love that they don't have any alcohol. This is the package. When you open it, it's a lot smaller, a lot more compact. And I like that it doesn't have the water. I think I'm gonna prefer this one. At least for traveling purposes, I think this is gonna be perfect to put it in my bag or Shrek's backpack and travel with them. 
For reference, Shrek weighs 7 pounds. In the packaging instruction, it say with one packaging should be enough to do his whole body completely. This hypoallergenic one only brings one single glove, so definitely if I was gonna be using it with Venus or Apollo, I would have to use two package. So I want to start with Shrek's face and head, then I will do his body. Normally he is pretty clean, I bathe him once a week and he goes to the groomers once a month. But his ears and on top of his eyes, he gets really, really dirty. His ears are the worst. They always have a lot of wax built up. So I want to try to use them for that purpose. I think that will do really good, especially if he lets me get in there. You could see all the gunk that came out just from one ear. Let's try to do the other one really quick. And surprisingly, he's letting me do it way better than when I'm trying to do it in the shower when I bathe him. The smaller the dog, the easier to get allergies from the ground, from the grass, from pesticides or things that you put to make your garden grow because their nose and their mouth is a lot closer to the ground versus a large dog like Venus on Apollo. There's at least three feet from Venus's mouth to the ground. So this, I see it being useful, especially if you know you put any pesticide or anything to make your grass or garden grow. You should clean your pet when you're bringing them back inside. And winter is over, but a lot of places here in the US and Canada still have snow on the ground. And those salts that people use to put in the driveways to get the ice off, that is very harmful for the paws of your pets. It could create a lot of allergies. It could create even burns. So I could think you could use something like this to clean their paws if you have put a lot of salt or if in the street they put a lot of salt during the winter months. When we are done with Shrek, it took us around 3 minutes to do all his body. I clean all his face, his back, his belly, his private area. And the glove didn't come out super dirty, but you see the spots where I did his ears that came out really, really dirty. For comparison, I'm going to show you the wipes that we regularly use. Mostly with Shrek, we don't use them very much with Venus on Apollo, especially because they are so big and the wipes are so small. Look how small it is compared to my hand, and I have really small hands. As you can see, they are very thin, almost see-through-ish, and they're very dry. I'm passing it in my hand, and you could barely see any wetness. They feel a little bit moist, but they're not super wet. You could tell in my hand they almost look the same. Well, that was it for today's video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Bye!